Hi, and welcome to Pagan Perspective Wednesday. I'm your host, Dancing Rabbit. Tonight's topic is ethics. Ethics is the branch of philosophy that answers the question, what's right, what's wrong, how can you tell, is it always right, or does it depend on the circumstances? As a pagan who draws primarily from Wicca, I guess my basic ethic would be the Wic Wiccan read, and it harm none, do as you will. The Wiccan read is very similar to the Golden Rule and its equivalent in other religions. Basically, treat people right. Now, I follow the read not because I am Wiccan and I must follow the read. I don't consider it prescriptive, but rather descriptive. I feel that the read describes what I believe as far as ethics, that you shouldn't deliberately try to hurt somebody. You ought to be nice, you ought to be kind, you ought to be helpful, as long as it doesn't end up hurting yourself. When I say harm none, I certainly don't mean that absolutely. I don't think you could go through life absolutely not harming anybody. You couldn't do anything. You'd be paralyzed with fear that you might hurt somebody. No, I mean in more general, more realistic terms, that you shouldn't deliberately hurt someone. And if you do, you should apologize, and if possible, make it right. You've offended a person, not a deity. So there's no going to God and begging forgiveness. There's no making sacrifices or depending on the sacrifices of someone else to pay for your screw-ups. Magical ethics? Well, I don't have magical ethics that are different from my just regular everyday ethics. I apply the Wiccan read and it harm none, do as you will, to my daily life. I try not to hurt people. Other than that, I feel like that I should be able to do what I want to. If I decide that I want to help someone and it doesn't hurt them and it doesn't hurt me, then why not? Threefold law the law of return, karma. I'm not sure that I believe that everything that you put out comes back to you three times. I think sometimes it does come back to you. Your actions are like ripples on a smooth pond and they move outward, they affect other things, other people, and sometimes they bounce back toward you. I don't know if there's a reward or punishment in a future life. The idea of Summerland is a really nice idea. The idea of reincarnation makes a lot of sense, but whether they're actually true or not, I have no idea. I'll find out when I get there. I do believe that if a person consistently does harmful things, whether they're magical or mundane, that it changes who they are. It changes their character. I don't believe that you can be truly happy by making people unhappy. Well, that summarizes my ideas, my random rambling thoughts on ethics. And it harm none, do as you will. Till next video, this is Dancing Rabbit. Peace.